Hey there friends, on today's video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to add or delete stocks within your watch list on the Webull app. It's really simple, let's do it right now. Okay, so as you can see, we are currently on my homepage. This is where you will go when you download the Webull mobile app to your cell phone and log in. So I have a watch list obviously with a number of different stocks here, individual stocks as well as the Dow Jones, the NASDAQ, and then a few cryptocurrencies. Now, again, I wanna go ahead and delete a couple of these that I really don't care to follow anymore. So that's the first thing we're gonna do. And what we need to do is come up to the top right-hand corner and you can see those three dots that are there. I'm gonna click on those. And you can see we have an option at the bottom that says edit this list. So this is gonna bring us to this screen. And what you're gonna do is just simply select the specific identifiers that you'd like to delete. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this ETF. I'm gonna delete Apple and I'm gonna delete Google. Once you're done selecting the ones you'd like to delete, you can come down to the bottom, hit that delete button. If you simply wanna reorganize the way that you see some of these things, you can actually grab those three little lines next to a specific stock and you can actually just push and hold and move them around until they're in the correct position. I'm gonna go ahead and hit that delete button. It's gonna ask you, sure you wanna do this? I'm gonna click done. And then once we go backwards, you can see that my watch list will update. Okay, now what if I wanna to add to my watch list? So the easiest way to do this is actually just to go up to the top and hit that little search icon. And that is gonna bring us over into an area where you can search. And again, even if you don't know the three letter or the, the short letter identifier for your specific stock, you can simply type in a company. So let's do T-Mobile. And I'm gonna to have to actually put that dash in order for it to find it. And as you can see, we have a couple of options there. The top one looks like it is the one that's currently listed. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and hit that plus button. And as you can see, it goes directly over to my watch list. I'm gonna hit the cancel button now up top. It's gonna to go back to our watch list. And as you can see, T-Mobile is now added up top. Friends, it really is that easy. Again, just make sure you are spelling your company correctly if you don't know those short letter identifiers on the search function. And yeah, make sure you have some fun putting in some companies that you're interested in. Take a watch, take a look at them. Make sure you kind of understand before you invest. And stay tuned. We are gonna actually make a bunch more Webull tutorial videos to help you out. If you guys haven't signed up for an account yet, there's also a link in the description box below where you can get a free promo. I'll get some free stocks, you get some free stocks. It really works out great for everybody. Hey, thanks for watching, and we'll see you again on the next one.